What's up guys, welcome back to another video and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to download Windows 10. Now first of all, I questioned myself, should I actually make this video? I was like, a few clicks here and there, Windows 10 is going to be on my computer as simple as that. It was not as simple as that. I had to go through a lot of black screens, some restarts, some uninstalling, and then I finally reached Windows 10 after 5 hours. Now I definitely don't want any of you guys to go through 5 hours of just researching and you know all these horrible things. It was not a good time for me. I was really frustrated, but I finally got it. And uh, after that, I looked back at it, and it was actually not too hard. So what you guys want to do to start this off is head over to your desktop. Now, as you guys see on screen here, this is the Windows 8 desktop. I did happen to record this before I upgraded to Windows 10. So what you guys want to do is go over to the bottom right-hand corner, and as you guys see there on screen, it says Get Windows 10. Now, once you guys open that, it will allow you to have certain options like reserve my free slot you know you put in your email and all that kind of stuff and I did that I, I did all of this now I believe that it will notify you once you are ready but I just went ahead and forced downloaded Windows 10 if you guys want to go ahead and do that here is the video on how to do that now also when I did this I did have a few errors and I'll tell you guys uh, what I did to fix those so what you guys want to do to start this off is head over to your folders now once you're here at your folders as you guys see on screen head over to the C disk now for me that's my local disk and once you guys open that up go ahead and go down to Windows. Now once you double click Windows you guys want to scroll down to software distribution. From there go ahead and open up downloads. Now in the downloads folder you want to delete everything in there and for me I ran across a couple of issues. I believe I clicked delete too many times and a lot of tabs just popped up so I had to kind of skip those and continue. I don't know what I did actually but I finally got all the files to delete. Now once you are finished deleting all those files, what you guys want to do is close that down and head over to the bottom left hand screen and go ahead and right click and go up to command prompt admin. Now once you guys see that, go ahead and open it up and from here what you guys want to do is type in w-u-a-u-c-l-t dot e-x-e space slash update now. Now from here what you guys want to do is head over to your control panel and then type in on the top right hand corner windows update now once you are done with that go ahead and click that and as you guys see on screen it says downloading windows 10. now my first time doing this it did happen to fail now what i did to prevent this was i disabled my antivirus software i re-downloaded it did the same process deleted the folder went back and typed in the same command and then i downloaded it again and then bam there it worked i had windows 10 within about 30 minutes or 45 minutes it did take a long process but once you got to Windows 10 it was a bit glitchy uh, there's a black screen you're gonna have to kind of fiddle around with it maybe uh, restart your computer and then you should be good from there after 15 minutes of just messing around with the windows then you should be good everything should be back to the same size and you should have Windows 10 installed thank you guys so much for watching today's video I hope it did help you guys and I did go kind of fast in this video so if you guys have any questions I'll be glad to help you guys down in the comment section below and I'll list the steps again down in the description so thank you guys so much once again for watching today's video and I'll catch you guys all in my next video peace